Hi everyone, welcome to the latest Prima video. Today we're doing a tier list of British things. British stuff. Oh, Sunday roast. What are your thoughts? It's me. I, oh, I, okay. If I went home, I'd have a yeah. Sunday roast. But it's not like top, top. I think we go here and just see. Like, it could be chicken, it could be beef, anything. So yeah, it depends. Um, so there's, there's vegetables. Um, Gravy. A bunch of vegetables, gravy. Yorkshire, Yorkshire pudding. pudding. Sometimes oh. stuffing. Sometimes. Um, some type of meat. Yeah. Turkey, beef, chicken. chicken anything. Um, anything. Yeah. And what uh, else? Generally Brits have Potatoes. it on Sunday for lunch. Yeah, yeah lunch and dinner. Yeah. It's there. It's there. That's where we're putting it. Cheese rolling. What? This, this, okay, I've been to one of these. There's one near where I live. Mate, you're such a weirdo. It, no, no. <laughs> but basically. They roll cheese down a hill. They roll a cheese down a hill and everyone chases it. But people get like really injured. So look, it's the guy who gets his cheese down the hill the first or? But they end up, they end at the bottom of like a broken arm and a cheese. So it's overly British. It's a silly tradition. Getting sunburned even with sunscreen. I mean, this is just obligatory. That's you. <laughs> this is just British. So uh, it's terrible. Yeah. I don't want to associate myself with these, uh, yeah. with these people. These aren't our buddies. This yeah. guy's going down here. It's not. We don't want to see him again. Yeah, it's meh, because it is actually British. It does happen a lot. It does happen a lot. We'll go here. I'm not too proud of that. Not, yeah. It's not, our, it's not our finest trait. British humor. It's a bit subjective. I think, I think it's funny. I think it's funny. Think a lot of people find overly sarcastic a bit. But, uh, it's it's uh, me. It's up there. Even a bit more. We need to go more. Okay. English football culture. It's pretty good. Um, <laughs> but every time we have any kind of international tournament, it's, it's coming home. Yeah, and it never comes home. It doesn't. We're not very good <laughs> at so, football. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> football, we think we're very good, but we're actually not. No. No. I think it's meh. I, Proper meh. I don't really know. Like this, for I'm me, not a massive football it's kind fan. of a grey area. Between yeah. here and here. Depending on how we do it. <laughs> Could be, could be. I think we go, it's in the middle. Prop it's gonna be like right here. We've got the yellow. Yeah? Harry Styles. He's just meh. He just Sorry, exists. Harry. Yeah. I hope he's not watching. He's gonna be really disappointed. Yeah, he just he exists. <laughs> he's there. He's there. There we go. Having an opinion about Team Harry or Team William? I have no idea. I haven't even read one piece of news about no. this rubbish. I, uh, I'm not, we're not really They don't even this. deserve a magnet. No, just okay. leave it. I mean, the royal family, it's cool, but uh, yeah, I mean. Yeah, but I think this is just drama. Yeah, it's, it's like a TV show. Strawberries and cream for Wimbledon. I've never been to Wimbledon. Have, have you not? I've been once. Okay, then it's your, it's your. Um, I didn't have strawberries and cream at Wimbledon. Strawberries and cream are quite nice. Though. But strawberries and cream are nice. So, proper? Maybe bloody brilliant. Actually, it's bloody brilliant. Bloody brilliant, but it depends on what cream. But regardless. Okay. Say sorry, even if you've done nothing wrong. I think we're quite a polite um, yeah. country. We are quite polite. Um, I mean, for the most part. Like even if someone bumps into me, I'll say. Yeah, uh, like a mannequin in a yeah, shop. Sorry. I'll say sorry to a mannequin. <laughs> that's that's so me, actually. It's me. And, and yeah. uh, if something- I'm sorry for being a nice and guy. Also, if, if, if something bad happens to someone, you're, oh, I'm sorry. Even yeah. though it's not your fault, I'm sorry. So, yeah. That's it. We're just it's nice people. British. Nothing we can do about that. Yeah. Sorry, Ollie. I'm sorry, Zach. I'm sorry for, what did I do to you? We have, oh, I sent up your inside in turn nine in Zanvoort. Yeah, I turned in in turn nine in Zanvoort. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry. Guy Fawkes Night. Okay, this is quite British, so. Um, That's quite cool though, it's like fireworks. It's quite cool, so there was a, a guy, cool guy. <laughs> he tried to blow up the parliament building. Yeah, he tried to blow up the House of Parliament using gunpowder, um, it was in protest, I guess. Uh, he failed. Um, and, and now they uh, commemorate yeah, his failure. In his commiseration, we burn a fake Guy Fawkes every year. We call yeah. it bonfire, bonfire night. night. Exactly. It's nice. It's, yeah, um, it's cool. It's like everyone gets together, fireworks. fireworks and stuff. It's quite, it's quite cool. It's like I think every country has their own little yeah. kind of weird it's like holidays. A tech 4th of July. <laughs> That's our one. Yeah. I think it's proper. It's proper. It's not bloody brilliant. But oh, we're running out of yellows. It doesn't matter. We go green. Ow. <laughs> okay. English breakfast. Right. There's no denying this. Up as high as it can go. I love English breakfast. Yeah, I would have to. And I think a lot of people can agree. Yeah. Um, it's, yeah. it's it's just good. good. Like there's nothing. Okay. Like, get rid of the mushrooms and get and rid of the, the beans. Black, the black pudding. Beans. No, black pudding's not bad. No. Poached egg or fried egg. 
Mm, I'm easy, but I, I like poached egg or scrambled. Okay. Poached or scrambled. I like all eggs. Though. Bacon, sausages, beans and mushrooms. You know, it's not the healthiest, but it's... But uh, it's good. It's good. It's, uh, it's worthy. It's good hangover food as well. Yorkshire pudding. It's, it goes exactly here. Yeah, but if we're talking, Yorkshire pretty on its own isn't amazing, but with gravy, yeah. it's top tier. It's, we have a red. It's part of it, it's part of it. It's it, needs an, it needs its own. Exactly, it's, it's, it's part of the same thing. Okay. Having breakfast with porridge, or I mean having porridge. I mean... Having porridge. <laughs> porridge is just oats and milk, isn't it? So, uh, I don't I, think that's just English though, is it? I think is porridge it is, us, it's like a Scandinavian thing as well. Exactly. But I don't dislike porridge, just not amazing. Porridge I, is quite good. It's, it's good, it's a good source of... I think it's proper. Proper meh. I wouldn't say it's meh, it's nice. It's meh. But it's, uh, hold, it, hold it up. You missed. Wait. <laughs> Yay! Well, ben, I'm, out of, I'm out of magnets now. Okay, this is your one. Bathroom carpets. Well, I don't think it's British, but it's stupid because you have a soggy carpet, so this is just... It's not worth it. I haven't, had a, I haven't seen a carpet in a bathroom for a while, but uh, that can go down here. That doesn't even need a, a stick. I wouldn't say, is it British? I just think it's stupid. <laughs> Sleep in a Union Jack. Sleep in a Union Jack. Um, I don't do this. Um, I don't know many people that people do I think people who support like Royalists might do it, <laughs> but I'm not sure. I need my magnets back. Um, I have no opinion on it. I mean, meh. Maybe, it's actually, no, it's overly British. It fits of course. perfectly. That is it's actually, far too patriotic. That's marvellous. Marvellous is good. Marvellous. We Splendid. Should have, we should have marvellous. Splendid. Well, it's just... <laughs> Being royally obsessed by royals. Ah, this annoys me. It's I don't overly know what British. It's the same as about. it's the same as Prince Harry. It's the same as bed, bed sheets. Uh -huh. Okay. Um, yeah. I mean, like I said, they're cool for tourism. <laughs> Having an opinion about putting milk before or after British tea. Well, firstly, you always put milk after. You put it after. Uh, that's like putting um, milk cereal in, before. Yeah. Oh, milk before. Oh, cereal. Ollie. Sorry. It's always cereal before milk. I mean, maybe it's overly British, but I think it's in between. Ooh, you're getting better. My but yeah, group. I mean, you always have to put milk after because then you can adjust how much if you if you commit too early with the milk, you're in trouble. British etiquette. I mean, firstly, no one drinks tea like no that. one does that. <laughs> um, I think in general we're quite a polite nation. Exactly, it goes exactly with where is with, it? Um, saying sorry. Saying sorry. But it's not, but it's not me because I don't drink tea yeah. like that. Um, I think it's meh. It's like here. It's not overly British. Maybe we could cover the sunscreen guy. Yeah, it's really really it's like triggering it. me. Okay, Friday night fish and chips. Right, I think this comes from school, because I don't know about your school, but Friday was always fish and chips. <laughs> Meh. Meh? No, it's overly British. Uh, so we're changing the tier because it's me. It's not really me, but it's like good things. So we get rid of that. We're in a British mood. So we've got marvelous, splendid, and wonderful. Continue. The British art of queuing. Now this is what? actually, Okay, I think there's a lot of cues. Do you not know this? The British art of queuing. Like, we like queuing for stuff. And we're like good in queues, apparently. What? Yeah. You didn't know? What? Apparently, like, as a nation, what like, we do there's a, to others? we're stereotypically good in queues. Like, we keep single file and stuff. Oh. So, um... Isn't that just normal? Do other countries not See, do this is it. Yeah. Get it up to the top then. It's bloody splendid. <laughs> Ow. Sorry. And the final one is Marmite, because okay. I, I thought it, it would be like the first thing you mentioned, which is... Uh, Yorkshire pudding, I guess, correctly. One okay. of the reasons I'm not really proud of... Do you like food. Marmite? Not at all. Oh. Do you? I don't mind. Do you, you know tw Twiglets? They taste like Marmite. But not that, because they're like crispy, you don't taste it as much. Honestly, it's not bad. I, I was I'm gonna put it... Twi I'll bring Twiglets for you. I was gonna put what? it no, right this is unfair. No, okay. You, we split it in half. Because I like it. So you get the mum, and I get the ite. And I quite like, I mean, I think it's, it's, it's proper. It's not proper. It is proper. No, because... But what is it? Wooden no one board? actually likes it. Can I have my phone to check how many people would like... Well, how can you check that? Surely, there's, there was a... What, the Marmite polls? Yeah, there was really a poll. Yeah, but... I don't, it's British. It's proper British. Okay. Oh, no, you're ruining it. So, I think we've established that um, we're actually the best country in the world. Have you noticed, actually, contrary to popular belief, British food is marvellous. 
slash splendid. No, we do have good food. I mean, people people slate us, but this is really nice. We kind of steal from other nations, but it's, it doesn't matter. A little bit. It's good. Anyway, um, yeah, I think that's about it. That was the video. Um, I hope you learned a thing or two about the UK. And uh, yeah, if you have any questions, we're here for you. And we'll say sorry. And yeah, we'll, we'll apologize. We'll apologize. And we'll have an opinion on tea. Thanks that's for watching. And uh, I think that's it. And we'll see you soon, I guess. And sorry. And sorry.